Sidvader24 here, and I'm back with another my, uh, Mac tutorial. Why did I say Minecraft? So used to that. A whole bunch of need off look. Uh, anyway, today on this Mac t uh, tutorial, I will show you how to do the matrix effect in Terminal. So first, what you want to do is you want to open up Terminal, and you want to type in while, sorry, while, like, while we're going there, space, opening bracket, true, True, close bracket, space do, space echo, space dash n, space like two commas, and then you want to type in small, not too big of a number, so I'm going to do that. You close it off, you want to do a semicolon, and then I press done, and there you go. You got the matrix effect. So the less numbers you do, the better it will be. See, I did less numbers here. You know what? Let me show you what it's going to be like. And to quit it, you just do uh, Command Q. And now I'm going to show you what it's like if you put too many numbers. So this is why you don't. I spelled Y wrong. And make sure you spell everything right too. Uh, do echo. My name. So yeah. So, uh, just type in a humongous number there. <gasps> there we go. Oops. Oops, yeah, I did it wrong. Look. It's about too wrong. Yep. Yeah, hold on. Here we go. I'm sorry for this. You yeah. Enter. There you go. So I did a bigger number here. Look what happens. Well, same thing. It's just going a bit slower. If you didn't realize, it's going to go a bit slower. So the, the bigger your number is, it's going to go a little slower. Because when I did it before, it was cool. And, uh, yeah. But when you do it like this, full screen, hot. You got it cool. So I hope you enjoyed this Mac tutorial. Um, I'm going to be starting a whole bunch of these Mac tutorials. And uh, yeah, so thank you for watching. And have a very good day.